Hello guys, welcome to the next episode of Banished with me, Biffa. I hope you are keeping well, having a good day today. And we're going to be working on quite a few things today. We're going to be looking at orchards, we're going to be getting silkworms going, and maybe adding a dairy as well. Ah, oh, the houses are going up, fantastic. So hopefully these farmers will move into here and we'll start getting a few more children because we've been a bit uh, we've been a bit lax on the breeding part of the game. Uh, we haven't made many houses basically. So let's head over here first. One of the other episodes. Oh look, these guys are making milk as well, aren't they? They are. We bet we've got tons of milk. 592 milk. We need a dairy. I made this last episode. There we go. Where does he pick up and take his stuff? I bet they're storing them over here, aren't they? Let's have a look. Here he comes. Nope. <laughs> He's got them in his inventory. He's probably taking them somewhere else. But these make milk. Look, as we've got there. But I forgot we've got these cows over here as well. And they're making milk. Freezing cows. So we definitely need a dairy put somewhere. Um, And I'm thinking... I'm thinking, I'm thinking. What are you guys needing? Clay. This clay is still a problem. Yeah, that one's not working anyway. Let's see how big the dairy is. It's going to be in one of these, isn't it? Raw food gathering, food refining. Here we go. Dairy. Makes butter, cream and cheese. All of those things from milk. So that's good. <clears throat> I'm thinking up here somewhere. Would be a good place. By the school perhaps? Over here? Yeah, over here. The other side of the road. Let's see which way round that needs to go. Can't quite tell what the front is. I think that's... Mm, I'm not entirely sure there. Oh, that looks like the front, doesn't it? You've got like a front door. On that side of the building. Yeah, so let's do let's do it this way round. And let's pop that up against the pasture that we have here. And we can run that road along as well, can't we? we do that? Yeah, let's do that. Let's pop that there. Let's continue that key road all the way along. There we go. Excellent. I'm going to put this here so I don't forget <clears throat> that that's going to be made. Quick sip of tea. Wet the old whistle. There we go. So that's that one. So that's going to hopefully give us even more food from all this milk that we've got here. overflowing. We've got overflowing with 623. Lumber. We have a lot of lumber. Who is the guy making the lumber? Because, to be honest, you could probably stop making the lumber. It's you, isn't it? You can be switched to firewood for a while. Because we have a lot of lumber. Um, oh, traders coming in. Ah, something we're going to need at some point. Where's he going? He, he sort of made an effort of missing that, didn't he? It's some white mulberry leaves or mulberry something or other. Oh, whole components. That's something else we want to get to. Oh, he's got a lot of stuff. Lamp oil, candles, healing poultice, furniture, fire bundles, tin logs, and copper. I don't think... Whole components might be good. I bet we could... I bet we could take those. Overpaying by a thousand. Okay, let's use coats to buy those. Really, coats are worth a lot, aren't they? We <laughs> don't... They're worth more than I thought. Uh, overpaying by... Oh, I'm going the wrong way. Let's go down again. Yeah, let's get those. Because we can start making barges and stuff. I want you to try that out, didn't I? I'm going to add that to my list. My list is getting bigger again. Do, 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 do. 15, 40, 25, 10. Additional five units. We'll use reeds. Five. There we go. Let's trade for that. Let's add barge to my list. Maybe for another episode. Thank you. Right, yes. Yeah, so... Dairy will be done. I wanted to also add a silkworm hut. We want to grow and use some of these silkworm eggs that we've got. And um, but it says there when they're when it's built, silkworms require white mulberry leaves. So uh, no thanks. We need to get the mulberry going. But we have the silkworm that we need for making these silkworm eggs. So let's... Yeah, silkworms get eaten. So keep that in mind. And we have lumber. Yeah, so that's fine. Uh, you can squeeze in here. Can you not? 
You cannot. Can you squeeze in there? No. You can't. Could you squeeze in down here? You could. Okay, let's just extend this key road out to there. Uh, which one was it? This one. There we go. I don't know why. It's under resource production. It always catches me out because I think of it as food. Let's grab that. And I think that's the way round we want it. Yeah, so we'll put that up to the path there. There we go. So we'll get one of those made. All oh, the dairy is nearing completion. That's good. And then we need to plant out some orchards. Because I forgot. We've been trading for a lot of stuff. So we've... we've you know, we planted all farms for these things, but we've got like chestnuts, and it might just be chestnuts. I thought I thought we might need more than that, but there we go. All right, we'll leave that one there, and we'll keep an eye. There we go. We'll keep an eye on what he makes for us. Yeah, look, we're running out of people suddenly. 166 citizens, homes 54, families 71. They must be living in a boarding house. Did I not make more than one boarding house? Oh, look, these are all finished. Look at this. Our nice row of country houses. That looks nice, doesn't it? Let's get a nice screenshot of that. There we go. Very good. We'll do one this way as well. <laughs> Always try one both directions. See what it looks like. There we go. Excellent. Um, so where would be a good spot for orchards? I'm thinking maybe up here, perhaps? I'm thinking if we put at least one orchard in, we can then see what, you know, how many different things we've got to grow. I was going to check these houses. What have we got? Every single one's got a family in. Excellent. We need a few more houses, don't we? We really do. Maybe we could back some of these up on here eh, I'm not sure maybe build some around the side let's do that instead what were these country houses I want to make sure that we're not going to suddenly get a big death wave and yeah not be happy about that uh, is that the path yeah that's the path we'll just squeeze as many as we can along here before we get to the hills and it stops us being able to do it yeah like there there we go Reach that limit already. And should we get the same over here as well? Why not? We're going to have a big population boom, but we're making enough food. So I think... Uh, where's the path? The path is there. So there. Line up, will you? Oh, that's it. That is it. We can have two more in there. Okay, let's have a quick look at our food. So we've used 18, produced 21. Yeah, so we're doing okay. But we are going to need to produce more. Let's get... Let's have a look. If I run another path coming straight up the middle here, we could probably fit a couple of orchards. The orchards are going to be 15 by 4. So that's going to be quite long and thin. So, yeah, let's do that. Um, how many out from the middle was that? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7... Eight. One, two, three, four, five, six. That was not in the middle. Okay, we'll line it up with this one here then. We'll go as far as we can. There we go. Hmm, 15 by 4 orchards. Orchards, orchards, or these are the ones I want. Standard orchards. Dense orchard with 2 by 2 tree spacing. So, the, the maths that I've looked up on the Banish Calculator, just Google Banish Calculator, you'll see that. Um, tells you that a 15 by 4 and a 7 by 10 orchard will give you 520 food per person per year. So pretty good. Um, the 15 by 4 takes up 60 squares and the 7 by 10 takes up 70 squares. Or llamas. I wanted to get llamas. Uh, because you can make a llama butcher which is this one here, yeah. Could I fit one in here? If I could squeeze one in there, that would be fantastic. 10 by 20, I knew that. Let's see. 
20 by 10. We can look. <gasps> Behind the school, they're going to have llamas. Fantastic. Okay, there we go. Oh, silkworm hut's done. Let's have a look at that. There we go. Let's add a person there. Silkworm. Silk cocoons. Yeah, so to make these, we're going to need mulberry leaf. And we do not have mulberry leaf. So actually, there is no point having anybody working there at the moment. So we'll close that one. We have another trader. Uh, food, food, pickled veg, sugar cookies. Got to check now for mulberry leaf. I don't think we need any food. We don't have enough reeds to suddenly chuck a load of that at food, do we? No. Although we've got coats coming out of our ears, have we? 364. So actually, not as many. I mean, if I did like 50 of those, that would give me 750 food. Yeah, go on. Let's let's treat everybody. Let's have let's have some papaya, and we'll have some bread. Go on then. Just give us a little boost in the food, and then you can go. Pasture's being done. So can we trade? Let's have a look for these llamas. What have we got in here? We've got a lot of stuff. So two llamas would be twelve hundred. So that'd be all of those. And then we need another 200 from something. What's that going to give us? 65? Oh, yeah, we can. Okay. I'm going to take them out of here. Yep. If you can remember that for me. Then as soon as that pasture is done, we will do that. And... Sometimes at that weird angle, I can't tell where I'm looking. Here we go. We could add... Next to that... There was the bison butcher. We could squeeze in here a butcher for llamas. Let's do that right there. Which way round do these go? Let's have a look. I don't think it really matters. No, they look good from any direction. Let's do it that way. Yep, there we go. So we'll have that as well. This guy isn't actually doing anything yet. We don't have enough bison, but that's fine. I think they've all taken their food over to here. Wow, that is nearly full up. Good grief. We need more storage over here. We've got a storage barn that is 100% full. I've had no warning messages about storage being full. Darn it. Um, let's just add another key path on the side here to get to that. Okay, we're going to need more storage around here. There is a storage option that you can use which holds on to stuff until you want to sort of send it out again, which I think is this one, the resource depot. So you can put things in there, hold on to them, and then if you suddenly have a shortage, you can send them out again. It's like a, it's like a storage, a storage storage, as opposed to just normal storage. I think that makes sense. Um, but how about, I mean, we've got these hills up here. There is a storage that goes into the hill, isn't there? Poisoned arrow to the knee, that poor adventurer. Is the, let's have a look. The magazine's good, but they're pretty big. We don't have room for that. Green silo. It's one of these. Bank barn. They're quite good. Must be built on a slope. Obviously not that big a slope. Okay. Oh, we could squeeze one in there. And that would make good use of that space. Look. Let's have a bank barn there. Do you know what? We're not going to have the bank barn there. Let's cancel that. Let's have the bank barn. Over here. Oh. Oh, that's, that's where our pasture's going. We shall not be having the bank barn over there. Let's have the bank barn back over here again. Resource depot, bank barn. There we go. Let's do that. Line it up with the path. Yep, there we go. Good. And then we'll just run that path along there. 
Yep, excellent. How's the pasture coming? The pasture's going well. Nearly done. Has it got all the resources? Yeah, it just needs to be built. The llama butcher, excellent. Another one for you. Although you're not going to be doing anything for a while because we don't even have the llamas here yet. We're getting there. Get that finished, come on. Okay, that will hopefully deal with that. There's probably some stuff here that we could trade away, you know. I bet we've got a lot of some items, like sand, fish. Wow, we are living off of fish in our town. Feathers, we could definitely trade a lot of those. Bamboo, I'm not sure whether that counts as food. Who's making the bamboo? We're not growing bamboo. Wherever they... I don't know. Okay, well, we won't worry about that. So there we go, 99%. Let's trade for our llamas. Dismiss. Thank you, llamas. Drop that down to one. Add another one. Hooray! There we go. We now have llamas as well. And I still want to get that orchard done. <laughs> I haven't got it done yet. That was going to be... We could fit an orchard in here just to see what options we've got. So let's go for a dense orchard, because I think we'll probably get more out of it. And we're going to go for 15 by 4. So how big is that going to be? Yeah, we're not going to have enough room there, are we? So what's that? 13, that's 12. Oh, that's a shame. What about here? 15 by 4. We could do one there. Oh, click the wrong button. Nope, one further. Okay, that was right, wasn't it? Oh my goodness, what have I done? I've made a weird, dense orchard. Let's <laughs> let's cancel that. Cancel. Thank you. Getting carried away there. Let's try that again. So I want it as close as that house as it'll go. Yeah, there we go. 15 by 4. Yep. I'll do another one next to it. I can. 15 by 4. How far up this mountain can I go with these? Well, apparently I can go quite far. 15 by 4. 15 by 4. We can have orchards all the way up the mountain. Okay, well let's see what this one is. We can only have chestnuts, so... Maybe we shan't do all of these with chestnuts. I don't think that would be a good idea. Let's wait for the first one to be done. Uh, these we will leave as unworked, I think. Yeah, we'll leave that for now. But at least we know. At least we know exactly what we can do. How's our bank barn coming? Let's angle that down a bit. Oh, our dairy's doing well. Look, we're getting butter, cheese, and cream. Excellent. So that's going to help us start going down the route of things we can do with that, because that can all be turned into other food. Okay, what have we got? Pewter, rough tools, bronze tools, stone. No, we're fine for all of that. Mustn't forget the mulberry leaf. I need to see what that was again and add that to my list so we don't forget. Mulberry leaf. Uh, silk with mulberry leaves. Yeah, so we need to get mulberry. I don't know quite how... I think we grow those... Mulberry, mul some sort of mulberry seeds or something like that. I'm not entirely sure. We shall have to see. Right, let's have a look in here. Logging barge. That's what I want to try. Collects wood logs or hardwood for the small price of a silver fennig. We can actually get silver fennigs from our population. If we build a courthouse, governor's office who collects taxes... But we need two of those things, which I don't know what they are. Let's have a look. Two fancy homewares. Okay. Could we could we do something to make two fancy homewares? Uh, who's the guy that can make the homewares? I don't think he does. It's going to be one of these. Homewares. Fancy homewares. Four fancy furniture. Really, is that the only way? Pewterware and silverware. Okay. Pewterware. Tin, copper and furnace fuel. 
Silverware? No. So we need a tin ore, a copper ore, a tin ore mine, and a copper ore mine. Okay, we need more mines. Hmm. Oh, here we go. Let's get one of these. Let's get this going with chestnuts. There we go. Extra person. And we'll leave the... Ah, you can pick up those yourself. These ones, maybe not so much. Hmm. What shall we do? Oh, the bank barn's been done. <coughs> Sip of tea. Let's have a look. Nice. Excellent. So people can take stuff in there and fill that up. Good. Um, so mines, 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 mines. I don't want to get all of these worked by people until we get a bit of a boost of more people coming in. Uh, let's have a look at this. <clears throat> Homes 59, family 73. I don't know where those extra ones are living. I'm sure we've only got the one... The one boarding house... Oh, these can be upgraded now, can't they? Do we have the muskets? Didn't we buy muskets last time? Yes! So we can upgrade these. Let's upgrade those. Excellent. Some more houses. How are you doing here? Firewood 987. Lumber we've still got... A lot of kumquats. No kumquats, but lots of lumber. Uh, yeah, mines, 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 mines. I'm thinking over here somewhere, sort of spread out. Because if we look at our market, if I can click on it. Come on, there we go. Covers a nice wide area. Yeah, I reckon mines up over here somewhere. Maybe not in the area of this so much. Because, I mean, he's doing well. He's collecting a reasonable amount of logs. I wonder how it would work if I had two foresters' lodges in one spot. That, that surely would affect the amount of wood we could get. Hmm. Thoughts of things to test. Oh, seeds. What do we need? Sunflower, canola, raspberry, herbs, herb seeds. Oh, you can grow herbs. I didn't know that. We're going to struggle to buy. How many can we buy? We could buy two 2,500s worth. Red mulberry seeds. That is not what these want. The, these want mulberry leaf. Well, maybe that would work. I thought they were white mulberry seeds, but we could try red mulberry seeds. How about something like that? If we add these reeds in as well, how many reeds do we have? 399. I could add those in then stop any more reeds going there. Overpaying by 1,760. What? Am I overpaying by... Oh yes, I'm overpaying by a lot. I want to drop that one down, put those in. An additional... Oh man, we're going to make it... 449. I don't think I am. That's going to be another 200. Furnish fuel. Oh yeah, we should be fine. Okay, let's put these in. Yeah, let's get those then. We'll grow those. Oh, an additional 99 units. You're kidding. Uh, let's leave that there. I'll sort that out. So, I mean, let me know in the comments whether you think those red mulberry seeds are going to work. Where do you think I should put my mines as well? You know, we need a we need a nice big area where we can put them. We could even go to the what would this be, the South Island and set up like a mining community over here. Let me know what you think. Have a look at the comments as well. See if you agree with what other people have put down there. And um, if you're new to my channel as well, if you like city building games, don't forget we have banished every day. We have City Skyline Snowfall by now, I believe. Yes it is, it's out already every day so look forward to that go and check that out and subscribe if you enjoy those and i will see you tomorrow in the next episode thanks for watching take care bye bye